There are 206 bones in the human body, but some of them just can't catch a break. Well, let's learn about five of the most commonly broken bones. The clavicle. The clavicle or collarbone is a peculiar bone found between the top of the rib cage and the shoulder blade. There is one on either side, so double the trouble. Clavicle fractures usually occur right in the middle of the bone. Injury or trauma from contact sports or car accidents are common causes of a clavicle fracture. The arm. The arm is composed of three bones, the humerus in the upper arm, and the ulna and radius in the forearm. The bones most commonly broken here are the radius, the ulna, or both. So you can get a cool cast and have everyone sign it. Well, but I hope it doesn't happen. Arm fractures commonly occur by falling on the outstretched arm or during a game of sport just gone wrong. The wrist. The wrist is a complex body part comprised of multiple bones and joints. The most common fracture occurs at the distal radius, which attaches at the wrist. Broken wrists are often caused when people put their arms out to prevent them from falling. The hip. The hip is a ball and socket joint comprising the femoral head, which is known as the ball, and the acetabulum, which is then the socket. Hip fractures tend to occur in the femur, which is the longest bone in your body. Well, that's what you get for showing off, femur. Accelerated calcium loss with age makes the femur increasingly more vulnerable to fracture. The ankle. The ankle is a hinge joint formed by the tibia, fibula, and talus. It bears the brunt of your weight every day, but it's not invincible. Any of these three bones can be broken, so step away from those stiletto heels. The ankle can be broken due to extreme pressure, impact, or overextension. And this is our list for the five most commonly broken bones. Have you ever broken any of these bones? How did it happen? Let us know on the comments below. Until then, I'll see you next time.